Okay, here we are, end of 2023. I've made a lot of videos on portable PAs. So here is my pick for the top portable PAs of 2023. Starting on the bottom is our new member, and that is the Alto Busker. $350, has some really good features. Again, make sure to, if you're interested in any of these speakers, go back and see the, the detail video. I'm just gonna touch on these really quickly. Uh, so it's very good pricing, $350, but uh, what I'm really enjoying is the featherweight. It's the lightest speaker available at 12 pounds. So that's the one I'm picking up and using quite a bit for portable use, uh, uh, backyard parties, beach, park, but it's not something I would really be interested in gigging with unless I use a subwoofer. It has a really nice tone, very nice clean high end. And if you put it on top of a subwoofer, you really have a, a great micro system. So very highly regarded, uh, just came out. So I can't really tell you about reliability. Hope got my fingers crossed it'll last, but I'm really enjoying it. Uh, there is another speaker out there a little bigger, and that is a Mackie Thumb Go. Um, actually, it's the same price. It went down from 400 to 350 but like I said, it's, it's larger, so I'm going to pick up the Alto Go. I'm sorry, I'm going to pick up the Alto Busker to go over the Mackie Thumb Go. Okay, going up in the hierarchy, and that is the very famous at this point, EV Everse 8, and that is $750. It is pricey, and other P portable PAs have come down this year in price, but because the EV, EV Everse 8 is such high demand and selling so well, uh, there's been no price decrease. It's staying at $750. So it is a really, it is my top battery performer and it puts out some really good dbs or max volume at 121 dbs and it sounds great it has all kinds of features it has an excellent app probably the best out there not probably the best app out there as far as i'm concerned and you can eq it but i just want to mention uh it does take some eqing you might be disappointed for the price if you don't know how to eq it properly but if you spend the time, it is, in my opinion, heads and shoulders above all the other portable PAs. And that includes the new Bose S1 Pro Plus. Of course, that's debatable. But again, watch my other videos and you can get more details. So that's my winner as far as portable battery PA. Now, it does jump up in weight to 18 pounds from 12 pounds from the Alto. But that is not uh, something that is a deal breaker. 18 pounds is still pretty manageable. Okay, going up and now at the pinnacle of portable PA, in my opinion, is non-battery powered. The Alto, by the way, was battery powered. And Bluetooth, EV, Everse 8 and Alto are both Bluetooth. But the QSC on top there, uh, is not battery powered, not Bluetooth. So it's more of a pro speaker. You need a mixer to run it properly. I mean, you can use it straight in a guitar or a mic, but if you want any kind of EQ, uh, it needs a good mixer. And it is the heaviest, you know, at 21 pounds compared to 12 pounds, quite a bit of difference. But still 21 pounds is, is super light. That's why I'm portable PA. So it's uh, the loudest speaker, obviously, and that's, I believe it's 124 dB, but it has all kinds of headroom. It has QSC six-year warranty, which is uh, very important if you're a gigging musician, or even not a gigging musician, because uh, personally, I've used my QSC warranty, and it comes in handy. Other warranties end at usually one year or three years the max, so that really comes in handy. QSC is built like a tank, it is roadworthy, and it's just, uh, you know, it's the speaker I would pick up if I was going to perform live, and I don't need battery power. It's just, it's just a great speaker, uh, beautiful, clean sound. 
It does probably need a subwoofer. Of course, it's an 8-inch speaker. By the way, the uh, EV Everse 8 was also 8-inch woofer, and the Alto is 6.5. So when you put the QSC over a subwoofer, uh, a 12-inch subwoofer, it is really a small um, portable PA solution that I think is probably the best. Now, if you want to spend a little more, there's always a little more you can spend, then I recommend the QSC K8.2, which again, I've done a comparison video. It's uh, more money, more volume, everything is more. A little more weight, it jumps up to 27 pounds. But I really think the, the CP8 is an incredible buy at $500. You can imagine that, cheaper than the, uh, quite a bit cheaper than the Everse 8 at 750. But you know, you're paying for that internal battery. But I have an easy solution if you don't mind carrying one more piece, and that is the QSC CP8 is easily run off a external battery source, and you don't need a lot of power. I, I run it off a 150 watt unit, and then you have, um, you know, you have your your mobility. You don't need AC, but you still need, don't have much EQing on board compared to the Everse 8. So there you go. These are my three top picks for 2023. Um, again, you need to go back. If you're interested in purchasing any of these three, you really need to see the more detailed videos. I'll put links down below. And let's see what happens in 2024. Um, personally, I have a lot of portable PA. I don't really need much unless something just incredible technology comes out, then I'll probably give it a try and jump on the bandwagon. But these are my three top choices. Latest weight, Alto Busker. Battery powered, EV Everse 8. And for real professional use, giggy purpose in front of an audience, I'm taking my CP8. Okay, happy new year. I'm glad, happy for all the new subscribers to my channel. Keep watching, there'll be more videos in the future. This is Bill.